Hello and thanks for joining me for another week with Mary's Dream Time Messages. I hope you had a wonderful week. Last week, um, the two cards that we pulled out was with Kura Wong, letting us know when we can move beyond painful experiences from the past, then, you know, we can move uh, forward with a lot more confidence and empowerment within ourselves. And, you know, it's not always an easy thing to do, especially when, you know, those painful experiences were pretty harsh lessons. And so, um, you know, sometimes we're still learning and figuring out what they are if we don't really know. And other times, you know, it's about that letting go. And so that's not always easy as well. But, um, you know, at any moment we can always turn a negative into a positive. And so, you know, sometimes we forget that. And so, you know, it's important to remember. The other card that we pulled out was with the white cockatoo, letting us know that we're living and, um, you know, when we can let go of the past, then, you know, we have a chance to live life, you know, actually the way that it's supposed to be and, you know, not how it kind of panned out. <laughs> and so, you know, with those two cards, you know, it was really putting a spotlight on the past and, you know, just, you know, reminding us, okay, what, what was there, um, you know, we don't need to hang on to it anymore. But, you know, um, you know, you may have had some kind of breakthrough this week and so, you know, that kind of, you know, opened the door up to something, um, a brand new experience, a, a brand new experience, which, you know, provided you with some hope and, you know, possibly even some healing to do with the past. And, you know, having a new experience that is more in line with our happiness is, you know, what we're trying to achieve here. And so, um, yeah, um, if you didn't have a breakthrough, maybe you were, um, you know, you were able to shed some light on some of those experiences from the past and, you know, just baby steps is all it takes in order to just keep moving forward. You know, you don't have to be moving at a fast pace, you know, all, it's, all that is important is that you'll just keep moving no matter how fast or slow that is. And so, yeah, I hope, um, you know, those two cards provided you with some opportunities to increase your happiness. And, you know, that's what it's all about. <laughs> and so, you know, the week is going, we're going to, blimey, Charlie. Can you believe it? Like, we've only got like four weeks to go until Christmas and, you know, it kind of creeped up on us like that. And um, so there's still time to get um, Christmas presents. But if you're overseas, I would say that this is probably the last week um, to kind of order something in order for it to arrive to you on time. You know, you know, last week would have been an even better chance for it to arrive on time to you. So I'd say that this week is probably the last week for anyone that's overseas and wanting, you know, something before Christmas. Otherwise, you know, just get in touch and let us know that you're after something, but you want it to be sent via express or speedy post so that it doesn't take as long. You know, and it will get there before Christmas, and so that's no problems. We can do that for you. And, you know, with everybody else, I, um, you would have noticed that we had the newsletter this week um, with some Black uh, Friday specials. And, you know, we had the 20% off canvas prints running until midnight on Monday. And, you know, it also had the update to do with the Dingo books because we've only got... Um, I think it's 16, 15 or 16 book dingo book sets left now. We're currently doing deliveries and so we appreciate everyone's patience and the deliveries will be taking place 
up until the second week of December because we have some quite a few to get through and you know this is giving you a sneak peek of the hard book that you'll receive um, to do with the um, Dingo Dreamings and so yeah I'm just giving you a sneak peek and so yeah the books look great and you know they were just running a little bit late but they'll be there before Christmas as promised and so um, yeah just we're just currently doing the deliveries and they will continue until the second week of December because we just have quite a few and so you know that was all explained in the newsletter if you received it but I'm telling you again now and so so there's no misunderstanding and so I appreciate everybody's support during Christmas and I was just probably uh, give you some more um, gift ideas before we end today and you know a Christmas can be such a wonderful time of giving and receiving but you know it can be challenging at the same time and so if anyone is feeling um, you know uh, having some troubled times during this Christmas then you know it's important that you um, reach out to someone that you can trust or you know just someone that you can talk to and that can lend an ear and so I would try to put some links down the bottom where you can get in touch with some people that may assist you this Christmas um, because you know at Art by Mary we always want to let everybody know that you're never alone and you know everybody is always struggling with something every single day and you know including me <laughs> even though it may not seem like that you know so you know we're all in the same boat and nobody is perfect and no one is any better than anybody else and so I just want to show you some of the paintings that uh, I featured not only on the social medias kind of this week the week that just went actually but also this week coming up um, you would have seen the Boo Book Owl which is Australia's favourite owl you know this one is original painting it's the first time that the Banksia wild um, native Australian flowers are featured in this one you know which are a pretty hardy flower and so it's got some pretty nice colors with the um, leaves sticking out of the branches and so you know if you're interested in this one go check it out you know there's the original paintings are selling out pretty fast and so there was another two that sold today and so you know they make such a great unique gift which comes with the spiritual story and the signed certificate of authenticity you know and so these will be the paintings that will be featured um, because we've sold a couple of uh, dingo paintings. We're almost sold out of the dingo paintings this year. And these um, paintings that I'm about to feature now will be, um, you'll see them come up on Facebook this week. And so keep an eye on these and, you know, you'll know that you know that you saw these in the video and so I hope there's not too much difference between what you're seeing on the social media channels and the original paintings and so this one is called um, full moon dingo which was done during a full moon and so um, you know this one is about just stepping out then you have um, you know you can be unsure when you're trying to step out do something new dingo is there to guide you and help you find that stability and you've got the rock there and the tree in the background and all symbols of stability and helping you step out as you know you face something maybe for the very first time um, or it could be something else and maybe it's a time of letting go as well which the full moon is on Monday the other painting that I'll be featuring this week on social media is um and you know the social media is what i mean by that is facebook linkedin twitter or instagram and so you'll find art by mary on any of those social media channels and the other um painting that will be featuring this week is the platypus dreaming of rain and so this one is about 
um, you know, the um, feeling of rain and how it can cleanse your spirit and your energy. And, you know, it can transport, transport you into another time or place. It's that, um, you know, the negative ions that you feel from the rain that comes down. And it's that connection that we have with that, with the water and, um, and so you here you'll see the platypus swimming in the water, but also has the lotus flowers, which represent unity. And that's the meaning that I give them and I have been giving them for a long time. So it doesn't matter what race, uh, color or color skin, or, you know, whether you're a male or female, you know, everyone is equal. And so, you know, it's all about unity. And so this one has such beautiful colors and lines and dot work. In that one and so go check that one out on the online store or you know we can read more about it when it's coming up this week on Facebook or one of the other social media channels and this one is such a beautiful one this one is called the uh, fam sacred family circle with um, rainbow lorikeet and butterfly and so you also have the um, serpent on the tree guarding the seed of life and you know the heart of creation is in the middle and you've got the rainbow <laughs> lorikeets and the butter white butterflies up the top and you can also read a lot more about this one has a lot of metallic paint in this one and you know when I feature them in the videos on the social media you can probably see the shine of these metallic paints and so yeah I just wanted to feature some of those original paintings for you um, this week and so they're such a beautiful and unique gift and they're only one of a kind and you know we've sold hundreds and thousands of originals on the store and so that's what makes um, uh, by Murray online store unique is because we sell a lot of the smaller original paintings which are a lot more affordable than the the larger ones and so we do have larger ones as well if you're interested but they are a lot more expensive and so I hope you have a wonderful week this week and I will catch up with you again next week and so I hope I hope you have a wonderful day bye for now